November the 18th, 1978, Jonestown, the People's Temple of Jonestown, where 918 people sadly lost their lives right beyond the sign or right beyond this gate the entrance to Jonestown behind there lies history a lot of history Guyana's history of a man by the name of Jim Jones Reverend Pastor Jim Jones he was a leader a pastor a reverend that encourages a brainwash a lot of people I think 999 people to follow him to come here to live most of them leave the United States of America they settled here back in 1978 and upon complaints from the followers they were kept hostage or you know lock up beyond their their will words went out to Washington the people back in America and then congressman Leo Ryan came here to investigate and upon leaving Jonestown heading to the Port Kaituma Air Strip many of them were shot and killed they were murdered by the order of Jim Jones it was believed that Jim Jones ordered the murder because he later command his followers to drink the cyanide and poison Kool-Aid it's a Kool-Aid but it's not Kool-Aid it's um it's something else. It's another name that they call it Kool-Aid. All right. It's on this document here. I found on Google. A 20-page document. He commanded them to drink the cyanide mix. Who didn't want to drink it? They were shot and killed or they were injected. So you had no choice. Those who tried to flee were killed as well. 918 died out of 999 based on this document on Google. Good morning from beautiful Port Kaituma. See my team there? Captain Blackby. Captain Blackby and your lovely wife. We all dress up. We got beautiful sunshine today. Look. See that? Look at the view here. Beautiful as could be. We buy we hotel. Be ready like Freddy. And where are we going down today? Yeah, you know? Jonestown. Jonestown. <laughs> Jonestown. You heard it right. Ready, man. Reverend Jim Jones. Create mischief. All right. I heard Guyana is going to restore that place to a tourist destination. Not sure when that's going to happen. But it's a great idea. Today, we're teaming up with... We tour guide the man i think is uh, keith yeah, yeah. keith yeah he's taking us down to jonestown hilltop and maybe machu's ridge Fal all right fall stop mm -hmm. oh not hilltop is fall stop hope you guys are doing all right brand new day here in region one which borders guyana and venezuela join us and let me go on another adventure in the back dam in region one, Barima Waini. We're down by the landing area here. If I go forward up ahead there, it's gonna take me to the landing. However, we are going to get some breakfast. Alright, through the crack to something a nice uh, bacon egg there. It's kind of early in the morning, it's 8 o'clock. We're hey, heading through the crack. Black by reach up an old part, not that one. This is where you call the crack. We got a lot of food. We had dinner last night by Auntie, right by the little stand there. Now, we break fast, kitchen in open as yet. Too early. So, we may have to skip breakfast. All right, but in the meantime, we are walking down the street here. We're going in, in search of a cooler. Check if this guy have cooler. Cooler. I sell cooler. Sons Enterprise General Store. Yeah. 
Man, here, but they know I didn't get the cooler, man. We gotta check the cooler. Nice, beautiful morning here, man. You know, it's nice and sunny. Yeah. Yeah, the store here. We're gonna check the mirror, get the cooler. You yeah, understand? Hopefully, we get. We get it because we want to add some tip. What's up, what's up? Yeah, yeah. Morning, morning, fellas. Yeah, yeah. All right. Good morning, good morning. Yeah. So we got a Chinese supermarket. What's this cooler there? You got a bucket of a beer. This is what we want to do. We want a cooler to put the beer. <laughs> so let me see if Chinese want a cooler. Let me see if I got from A to Z, man. Supposed to get cooler, okay. You can see a thick set of smoke there. You know, going up into the skies. Now, that is not healthy. Not sure what is going on, what they're burning there. Uh, someone told me they're burning garbage. But that looks like tires or something. But that's very unhealthy for life. All right? It, it, what am I burning there? Garbage. Garbage, a tire? Tires or something, all right. That's not healthy at all, I know. See the smoke? No healthy. All right, so. Not a Chinese store here. Trying to see if we can get and cool it okay. If not, we're gonna borrow one. Alright. So we're back in the crack and the restaurant under construction here right now. But the food done, you could smell the fish broth there. We're planting. Alright. So this this is the restaurant here right now. Tell me Big pot of food there. Nice. Big pot of soup. Nice. I got some beef soup there. And I got some beef cook up. Alright, so we got breakfast and lunch already on the stove there. Now look at this. This here. The view here boy. Looks so so awesome. And everybody hustle and bustle. We came in here yesterday, Saturday. And this barge were already here them by so two days ago. Now it's his store. Oh, he cannot offload the vehicle because there's another boat next to it. I wonder why the vehicles are still there. So they're trying to offload the little, um, the small items. This boat got a lot of fish that's still from, from yesterday. A lot of more cooked salt fish. Yesterday was the market day here, right? Oh, look, avocado up there, boy. Whoa. Avocado and lime. You know, I worry with lime. Look, uh -huh. a lot of lime from the tree, the mango and thing. I like this one, both here, like the Philippines, man, with the truly tap and so. That first world coconut, a lot of coconut, and you know, looks like fuel in those um, barrels, not sure. Could be water as well but hey this is beautiful here trust me couldn't ask for anything better than this here let's cook up walk real good eight o'clock a man and we eating cook up instead of soup tastes real good trust me now this is the end result lunch time to break fast I bought this food stick as lunch for later today in Matthews Ridge. But I ended up eating it for breakfast. Tastes really good. The man carrying some beers here, buddy. To find where you buy the beer from. Hey. Breakfast was tasty. Alright. We ended up eating out our lunch as breakfast. Trust me. Don't you worry, we pick up a second box of lunch. So we have same menu again for lunch. Cook up rice and chicken, all right? So, we got my man Salaro. Look, banana here, but we're supposed to eat banana for breakfast. Yeah, we got my man Salaro there. We got people up with the car, man. Now, we made a stop here at the gas station. 
right? We fueling up the car. <laughs> Look at this man fueling up the car there right now. <laughs> yeah, the new way to fuel up a car, buddy. This gas station don't carry a pump, an electric pump, <laughs> a manual one. All right, so we're just away a stone throw away from the um, waterfront. And I must commend GBTI Bank, Trading Industry. They have a bank here. This is awesome. All right, you want money, you can go in and get it. So, which is not a bad thing. So the other bank, the blue, the blue bank, Republic Bank, you all need to set up something in Comarca, all right? Or even GBTI. You guys can spread your wings to Comarca. You just need a small bank man with two tellers and a manager. That's all you need. Across there is a military base, Ghana Defense Force. Farther up the road, or up the hill, we made another stoppy by the tire shop, you know, by Toddy Tire Shop there. I'm get tires fixed right here from when you get it done. We got Bruce and Sons Hotel. Yeah, all these trucks, the guys that do mining. Now these folks are living at the bottom of the, of the hill, man, the hill foot. And way up ahead there, looks like a school. Like too much school. We headed farther into the back that way. What, what road is this, friend? It's Catwalk. Catwalk. We're on the Catwalk here right now. Approaching the Ornock. Ornock. Watch your hard work. There's a fire in the back of me right now. We got here by Port Kaituma, sub region office. I'm not very old, ain't it? So we're going to show you a shop here too. Alright. Let me give you a little view. As we go along, you know, ARD is about the journey and not about the destination, all right? We don't know what the destination holds, but for now, I'm giving you the journey. The journey to Jonestown. You know, we stop here to get some ice and water. We leave in Ornock and we turn, we made a right. Onto this road here, you would have seen this earlier. Is road. This is the Ornock Road now. Mm -hmm. Got you, got you. Just come off of Catwalk. We came off the Catwalk onto Ornock Road. Digital cell. Mm -hmm. So it seems like digital cell is working in most of the most interior areas. Yeah, than TNT. Yeah, but even if in, uh, in, the, in uh, the Rupununi, mm -hmm. same thing. Digital cell works more area and even yeah. better. More people use the network. Yeah, digital cell. GTNT is good in charge, tongue, you know? Mm -hmm. Barbies. In, in Barbies and so like the, 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 coast, the coastline, man. Mm -hmm. They're good down there. I think they got better service than the other network on the coastline, but in the back now, nah, they're weak. The water coconut up to the tree there, boy. The church, you too. This is Arnak as well, too. Oh, so. The um, manganese road, this road coming. Oh, for the manganese company, mm -hmm. the road coming up. To my left here. Yeah, this road going. Oh. Oh, so the mining manganese at the back there. 
No, this the, is where them store it. Store it? Oh. From my children. Oh, that where we see the, 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 the barge in the river there? Yeah, the barge is coming from. From there, right, right, right. Gotcha. Yeah. The store they say it is they're mining it all the way in um Matthews Ridge. Ridge. Okay, okay. Okay. Uh -huh. Gotcha. So how far up ahead houses are on, on the road here? Um, all the way through or just to up, to up, uh, like five miles. Five miles. Mm -hmm. After that it's jungle. See gotcha. one, one um, camp. Camp and study work. Yeah, we'll we'll go go farm and so. farm. Gotcha. So no gold mining I do around here? No. Okay, no so gold mining. We'll do a little farming. Farming and so. Mm -hmm. Gotcha. What area do the gold mining? Like from Wallabaco, go up 10 miles, 8 miles. Oh, going on to um, Machu's Red Side? And yeah, going to Fall Stop. Fall Stop, okay. Then I got Big Trek. From this area, the Pokai Tumo, the Machu's Ridge is how much right? About an hour and a half. Oh, hour and a half drive. Got you. It's a four mile start actually from here. Yeah. The, the next road, did you come in? Uh -huh. uh, bring me out up no, here. Oh, the other road brings us here, four mile. Yeah, this is old road. Yeah, the old road. Yeah, the old road. Road, all right. We're gonna bring you back in. Bring you back here too. Oh man. Uh, you got truck seal, man. One mile. That's it. Okay. Good. These folks with the charge. Seen houses. You thought we were making a lefty? No, this is um, a oh. four mile ball field. Oh, the back, they got a, oh yeah, you got a ball field showing you. Checkpoint 
Tutto il bar qui Tutto? No. This right here is a checkpoint. Well, the usual thing you gotta stop in and check in or book in your vehicle, driver name, just like in the uh, Rupununi. You gotta check in the driver name and how much passenger you're going in with and stuff. Alright? And this is common in most of Guyana. Alright, so we are at checkpoint heading to. Jonestown the journey continues we are about to enter Jonestown I'm gonna give you guys a walk through and an aerial view You're welcome to the people's temple Jonestown wow it's overgrown by bushes here right now man this is where 999 people you know, members from the Jonestown family, the church, were forced to take their own lives. So, the walk begins. We are walking to the temple, the People's Temple of Jonestown. Alright? And, you know, it's over, overrun by forest, you know, jungle here. Is there anything we can see, the tractor or any building or so? No, I don't see no tractor. I don't see no building. I'm thinking we're on the ground. Oh, you think this cover up? Mm -hmm. Wow. I just get to the end and get a, somebody get us a frame. Uh -huh. frame in the oh, so we can see something down there. Alright. And based on Wikipedia, you can see here. November 18, 1978, a total of 918 people died at the settlement nearby your strip at Port Kaituma and the temple run building in Georgetown. So it's 918 people. I can only imagine what the feelings was that day with these people, those who didn't want to, because there were some people who were injected, as I read on this document. Some people were injected with um, cyanide and stuff, different kind of poison. Some were shot. You got a motorbike track here? Somebody went to with a motorbike. Some of them were shot upon trying to escape. And Congressman Leo Ryan also was shot and killed. Several of them were shot at the Port Kaituma air, air strip upon trying to board their flight back to Georgetown. You know, several people died there as a result of the shooting. You can find all this um, information on Google or YouTube, I guess. I know there is a documentary, Jonestown, on the internet. My black boy coming through there. All right. We up there. There's a hill we got to climb up, you know. But I have four wheel drive, black boy. <laughs> Oh, you custom too. You usually bring people here for tours. I bring Panko them here. Panko them, nice, nice. So this man, the man Keith, professional tour guide. What your phone number again? Six six nine fifty three eighty three. Six six nine fifty three eighty three. For any taxi purposes. For yeah, all the tour, all the destinations. So what we have here now? This is the end. This is the end of Jonestown here. So where are these tracks? It's bush up. You bush up now, right? So where the, where the temple went? Which which one side? Up ahead here. I got oh. a house frame, okay. You got a house frame there? Let me go see if you can see the house frame. Bush up, huh? Well some here had a house frame. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I should take on some. You got them taking. You see them now, you know what? Back in go down. <laughs> wow, okay. Uh -huh. So, this is the farthest we can come right now. Everything else is overrun by bush. Really? You didn't see the frame? The bush wants to take it over. You had somebody to build a house here recently? Sometime back? Yeah, a frame. A frame from the Jonestown era or? No, somebody. Somebody came here and just built something. 
Mm. Oh. All right. Peace be upon the souls that lost here. I hope you are resting in peace. Are resting peacefully. So. This is all we can show you actually here right now. The, the one said it was going to restore you as long as a tourist destination. Yeah, but it didn't start yet. Got gotcha. you. And how far that probably the temple was way up ahead this way? Yeah. More than. Uh, we could do an aerial view and see if we can see anything. Set up the drone and fly and see what we can see. Yeah. All right. So let me give you guys an aerial view. Welcome to SSCLI e oh, Eclipse E C L I P S Eclipse Eclipse Falls Resort. Resort. So welcome to Eclipse Falls Resort. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. I got back the sign there, boy. I got check with Jay sign there, you know. I have a guest house here, like if you come, come down here. you can stay, get oh. rooms, rent and so Nice, nice. I got Jai said, I got impressions. You have to check for them on there for the, um, what's that guest house? Mm -hmm. From Payne, back to the side of Met, back to the side. Oh, so this is the files, eh? Yeah, this was done. What fish you can catch here? 
Ik ga lokken aan niet. Pirai. Arwana, Bayara. Ik ga lokken aan maar dan next time we ga het. Aymara. Aymara. We zijn op de fall stop. En we gaan nu even checken hoe die waterfall is hier. Wow. A lot of folks come out here, man. They probably wash the clothes and take a dip. Uh-huh. Well, that's strong current, too. Now, fish bro, if you went here, definitely fishing rod would have been in this water. Trust me. Aymara, my friend say Aymara is down here. The Aymara fish. We have it here. So, you made it to far stop. This place has potential to become a tourist destination, Hilltop. All right, that waterfall's there, simply amazing, relaxing. A lot of folks come down here to wash and to bathe and stuff. They need to clean up this vegetation, put a little step going down. Man, a lot of folks can come here as a tourist destination in Kaituba area here. And you know, tourist destination brings in revenue for the village. So I hope that something can be done or more can be done for this village here, especially the same waterfalls here. This is a rapids, you know. Fish bro, my say Aymara at the bottom there. Yui, Aymara. We're gonna be catching, don't worry. I learn in the, the grounds, you know, we're coming back. We had a milk back. This was a shop. Yeah. Shop there. What's up? What's up, fellas? Right. Yeah. So there's a hilltop. Shop. Hey, hold on, my hold on. What did my hand just say? Reverse back, boy. The <laughs> man just said something. I know, boy. Who said that? Uh? You or you? What's up, buddy? Pleased to meet you, man. Yeah, likewise. Yeah, man. Wait him. Yes. Yes. Nice man. Thank you for watching the show, right? You want to say hello to anybody back out there or so? No, no, we good. We good? We good? Yeah. Enjoying the, the, the jungle here? Eh? Yeah. All right, brother. Good to see you, man. Take care, right? Yeah, man. Hello. Hey, big up, big boy. Yeah, brother. All right. Yeah, man. So right off on there, man. <laughs> nice, nice. Watch how far are we there, boy? Have you? <laughs> In the jungle and people watching the show, boy. Yeah, are they reaching the length and breadth? How can life get better than this? And that's my favorite song, you know. <laughs> yes, yes. So how are them gallery say, well, no washing machine, you know. We went to the creek and wash your clothes there. The beater? We know what we grew up doing that. I grew up doing that. Only yesterday we saw that in um in by something by C by. Nice place. Oh, yeah, Nice, nice. Oh, we got fast. Stop, Bridgie. We are approaching. Some Chinese establishment. Oh, some Chinese building bridge. Oh, something back. Lovely. We got a little bar here, Blacks. We got to stop here. That can be very fast. Back, right? Bye. Bye. Okay. Oh, so this river taking the five star? Yeah. Gotcha, gotcha. Right. Owns good. them loads and buttons. Oh. So five star is what? Am I in the community? Yeah. Okay, okay. Nice. Yeah, it's some boats here. Who in? Brinsley. Brinsley. Oh. Mr. Brinsley landing. We pass him by here right now. So 
the journey continue now to Machu's Ridge. Baptist Church. Oh, it's a church. Uh, Lighthouse Baptist Church. And there's a school. Primary school. The school at the back. Oh. This is like the uh, center or something? Or the, the living quarters? The living quarters. Oh, the hostel for the teachers. They got the living quarters for the teachers, man. The school at the back. Oh, nice. There's a tush over here. There's a tush over here. You got a shop. What's up, what's up, buddy? <laughs> Complete your treatment. Hello, hello. Alright. Alright, the journey continues. So you saw it there, that's fall stop, we just leave and we're heading down to Machu's Ridge. I hope you guys enjoyed the tour with me of the journey from Port Kaituma all the way to Jonestown, then to fall stop. I want to thank you for the privilege of your time, stay safe and positive. Take care of you and each other. God bless you all. Peace out. And I will see you on the next adventure.